Yeah. What is up, my fellow bro gamers? It is I, Mr. J, two and three here from Bro Gaming Official. And yes, face reveal. Not really. If you go check out our older videos, we actually did two episodes of Resident Evil Seven that we did a face cam on, but we never got around to finishing that let's play. So, real quick, guys, before we get into this vlog talk show, smash that like button. Let's get to 20 likes right now and keep the growth of our channel moving forward. So guys, real quick, I wanted to do a vlog on what's next for our channel, what is going on, where are we going with this, so on my tablet I have a couple of points I want to go over. So guys, first on this list, if you know anything about our channel, we have a upload schedule right now of every Monday and Friday, that is when our videos come out, but last week we didn't have a video on Friday, it was on Saturday, I was a day late, and I wanted to quickly go over what that was, you know, the video on Saturday wasn't even really that much, and neither is this one. It's not gameplay. So I wanted to do this video to talk to you guys what is going on. Well, the past week, you know, it has been really rough for me. It has been one of the worst weeks of my life, probably really in a long time. You know, it's, it's just been terrible. I let go of really the most important person in my life, and I, I realized I made that mistake. And I've, it's, it's been a tough time the past few months because of everything going on with me trying to start up the channel and work at home and she's been so busy with work and school it's just been a terrible past few months for everyone really and you know I I made a big mistake and I let her go but guys we are working with it we are working together and getting that fixed and things are looking up you know Thursday I thought everything was gonna be okay things were looking up I felt life was gonna go great and then on my way home I get in a car wreck and it was like what the fuck because that was actually the first car wreck incident I've ever had. It wasn't that bad, but you know, still, nonetheless, it was uh, it was not that good of a time. Luckily, it wasn't my fault. I will be getting it all fixed. But moving on, you know, it's just it's just life, guys. Shit happens. You know, you gotta work with it, move forward. But you know, it's it's been a tough time for me because of because of all that. I've just haven't really felt like doing much of anything. You know, I know a lot of people out there. They probably know the same position that I was in this past week and I still kind of am there but you know I'm moving forward I, there's nothing I can really do about it I've just got to let let it move forward and see how it goes so you know like my dad told me he said that it's the best thing about life is tomorrow you never know what's gonna happen and whenever he told me that I really started thinking I was like you know you're right I can't sit here and dwell on the past I've got to move forward as much as I want to hang on to it I can't it's not gonna it's not gonna help me it's just gonna hurt me so I've done everything I can with that and we're moving forward together and fixing it so that's all I can do about that so I can only look at the other things in my life and push forward with those so that next thing I have to push forward is this channel for you guys so we're moving forward and with that I know that in some of my last videos I talked about Brian and I doing an Outlast 2 Let's Play you know I kinda hyped that up a little bit teased it but we were going to do it, but now we're not. You know, we got the game, did an episode or two, and we just, we weren't really impressed with it. We were honestly pretty let down. We didn't really feel like the game was even worth doing a Let's Play on. You know, we just, we kind of gave up on it. We didn't want to waste our time doing it since we have other things that we're wanting to record right now, and we just didn't want to sit through it and do it. We, we just, we weren't impressed. We didn't really feel like it was what they said it was going to be, so... There won't be an Outlast 2 Let's Play, guys. Really sorry if you're looking forward to that. But, you know, that's just, that's how the cookie crumbles. Anyways, moving on. This is something, the next point that I've been asked by a couple of people. I've been asked by a couple of subscribers, you know, what's up? Is this going to be a Mass Effect channel? Well, guys, it is definitely not a Mass Effect channel. You know, the past roughly 20 or so videos have only been Mass Effect videos. I've been doing a lot of build guides. Well, that's because personally I love the Mass Effect series. I've been a huge fan of it since the first one. So I really felt like I could do build guides for you guys and I thought they would really be good content and I was right. It's got us 30 subscribers and I just want to say thanks to all of all of you guys who are subscribing off of that. And, you know, I don't want to scare you off by saying this isn't a Mass Effect channel. We will definitely be doing more Mass Effect videos, you know, as more characters come out, I will be doing build guides on them, updates, you know, new maps, everything going on, I will still be doing Mass Effect content with all the other things that we are doing. So don't, don't fret, there will still be Mass Effect content on this channel in the future. But we have to move on 
for what's next. What are we doing next? Well, guys, next I want to talk about some of the four games that we are most excited for right now. As I'm in my little studio area of my room because I don't have another room to do a studio in. So I have it in this little corner for all my desks and all my everything. I have a board right here to my right that you cannot see, but it has a list of all the things for the channel and what we're going to do. And I have four games right now on there. So guys, those four games and list of how hyped we are for them. First on that list is Call of Duty World War II, guys. We are super hyped for that game, especially because we are hoping that Modern Warfare 2 Remastered is going to be coming with it, guys. We are super hyped for that. We are really excited, ready for it to come out because we're going to be doing a lot of coverage on it. We won't be doing any um, pre-hypes for it, I guess, you know, news and updates. There's plenty of other bigger channels that are going to do it that I don't want to take the time to sift through the information to bring it, you know. I know that a lot of other dedicated Call of Duty YouTubers out there will be doing videos on it. I've watched some of them, and guys, the hype is real for all of the news and info on it, guys. So... I'm really going to be sitting back waiting for it to come out. We are definitely going to have it day one, getting content out for you guys. Next on that list, Destiny 2, guys. We were big players on Destiny 1. T-Boss was more on Destiny 1 than I was because I didn't have a raid group to play with, so I was kind of more of a solo player. I did more PvP than him, but he was always doing raids, so I don't know. We, we weren't playing a lot together whenever that was happening because... Whenever it was out, it was more of a time whenever he was being shipped out to basics. So whenever he got back is when we got together and started this channel. And that's where we are now, guys. We're moving forward. Him and I are together in this, doing this. But, you know, with that, he doesn't have all of the equipment that I do to really record and edit and post stuff for you guys. So really, right now, that is what I'm doing. That's why you're seeing so much of me doing all of these videos. But in the future, you will be seeing a lot more of him doing a lot of videos for you guys and pushing this channel forward and that is where I want to bring my next point in around June or July PC gaming right now for all of you who do know we are on Xbox one but in the summer months we will be on PC we will be doing both and maybe in the near future we may be on all systems we will just have to see how that goes but right now we're just stuck to Xbox and that really limits us to who we can play with from our subscribers and that really that's something that kind of bugs me because I want to be able to get in a game with any of my subscribers, whatever they play. You know, it's not about what system you play on. It's about, you know, the fact that we're all gamers. It's this channel is about gaming. It is a gaming channel for gamers by gamers. We want to do this to share all the content that we play, that we do to you guys and just build a community around that. That is what we want to do. That's what this is all about. That's what we started doing YouTube for is that very reason. It's building a gaming community here on YouTube. So, PC game game. Wow, what? What did I just say? PC game game day dang. Anyways, PC gaming coming in summer, guys. That is what we have in store probably next. That's probably the next thing, you know. Right now we don't have a lot of games on the radar. I know I did say that there were two other games, but Whew, those games, not a lot of info on them. The, the information on those two games are pretty scarce as of release dates, but those two games, you know, a lot of people may be able to know. If you're a fan of State of Decay, here it comes, State of Decay 2, guys. We are very excited for that one. You know, with the inclusion of multiplayer in that, I am very excited for Brian and I to be playing that together with some of our subscribers because we will be needing two other players, guys. We'll definitely be picking up subscribers here and there for game nights on that game. That is something in the future that whenever we have our game nights set up, that will be on top of the list for game nights. That is something I'm really excited for. And another one that I really am excited to do game nights for is Sea of Thieves, guys. If you know what Sea of Thieves is, you know where I'm coming from. If you don't, definitely go check out some Sea of Thieves gameplay. It is something I'm really excited for because I think that game would just bring out some crazy and hilarious moments. Just a ton of fun. It looks like a blast to play. And I'm really excited for any more info and a release date on that game. I'm really excited to get down on that game. It looks like it's going to be a ton of fun and I'm really excited for it. So, I know... On this next point, I've kind of teased it a little bit on videos here and there, but some throwback gaming. And I want to talk about that real quick, guys. Let's 
let's talk about what I mean by throwback gaming. Now, I started gaming when I was very young, and so did Brian, you know, so did a lot of people. But whenever we started gaming, you know, we started out on, like, original Xbox and PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2, around that time. I started out on original Xbox and PlayStation 2. That's where I started. But, and I started playing everything with my brother on Xbox, you know, Halo. That was our game. We played loads and loads of Halo all night, split-screen gaming, you know, that's what we did. So I kind of have been wanting for us to do a little bit of a throwback series, you know. I played a lot of video games with my dad whenever I was growing up. You know, he got into it just as much as I did. And you guys are going to have to wait and see whenever we do that. So, it's something I'm really excited to bring to the channel. So, next on the list, you know, I've talked about game nights. Guys, I'm really wanting to do some game nights. I don't know all of the details yet of what day or time to set those up. You know, I'm wanting for us to grow a little bit more. And right now, you know, like I said earlier, we're limited to just game nights on Xbox, but whenever we get on PC, we'll be able to broaden that, but, you know, it's, I want to set up game nights for our subscribers who enjoy watching our our content to be able to actually get in the content with us and have a chance to play, you know, that's something a lot of people, they're always like, their dream, whenever they have a favorite YouTuber, they always watch them, like, religiously, they're always like, man, I wish I could play a game with with that YouTuber, and that's something that we want to do, that's something that we want to, you know, this is going to be a community, we want to be able to play with all of our subscribers whenever we can on game nights, and that's just something that we really want to do in the future, and that we really want to set up, you know, this is, it's not going to be a YouTube channel dedicated to anything, it's, it's a community, we want to build a gaming community around this YouTube channel, and that's, that's what this is all about, guys, so... You know, we're wanting to set up those game nights as well as some channel conferences. You know, I don't know how many more of these vlogs I might do. I may end up doing them, you know, here and there, maybe once a month or once every two weeks just to keep you guys up to date on what's going on. You know, I don't really know. It depends on how this video goes and how you guys react to the news and how you enjoy this kind of video. But we would like to do something like a channel conference, more like an Xbox Live party or a Skype call conference. To be able to sit down more one-on-one -on -one or, you know, in a group with our subscribers and be able to talk to you guys, get some feedback, and see what you guys want to see more of, and just a way to set up game nights. You know, that's something I'd be really interested in doing whenever we start growing more. You know, over the past month, we've picked up 30 subscribers, and guys, I'm so appreciative of you guys, and I really want to keep that going. You know, it's, it's at the end of April right now, and next month, I want to be at 100 subscribers next month. I really want to push us and get us there. You know, I want to keep growing and just build a great community around gaming and I think that having game nights and conferences like that are a great way to do it that's really where I'm coming from with that and I think that would just be a ton of fun and it would just be something really cool because there's not a lot of big YouTube channels out there and I know that this is not a big YouTube channel it's a small YouTube channel but as we grow I want to still keep that I want to keep us as a community I don't want to become separated from my subscribers, I want everyone to be able to enjoy everything. That's that's really where the reason that we built this is that reason alone is building a great community full of great people and having fun playing games together. That's why I wanted to do this. And I thought that having gaming nights, channel conferences would be a great way to do that. You know, that's something that I'm really right now I have linked to Patreon guys. That's my next point. If you if you really want to support our channel, the best way to do that is head over to our Patreon account. That right now, that is the best way to help us do more content, more videos, faster videos, more upload days. That's the best way to do it. Also, that's the best way right now that I have to set up game nights because that's really the only way I know how to do it right now. In the future, I'm going to change that. But we have a couple of rewards on Patreon, and that is what I want to skim over real quick is um, more rewards in the future. You know, as we grow, I want to be able to do more rewards. And whenever we hit a certain subscriber count, I'm not sure when that count will be yet, but whenever we hit that, I really want to be able to like open up a merch store. Now, as you can see right now, the shirt I'm wearing, I would like to be able to do stuff like that. You know, it has Bro Gaming Official, YouTube, and then on the back, it has our cover art, as well as Bro Gaming Official, and my gamer tag. And that's something that I think would be really awesome to be able to bring out for you guys. So 
and you know I wanted to have T Boss's name on there as well. But the site that I use for the shirt, you know, they didn't have a lot of layout, so it was pretty limited on what I could do. So I just made this shirt that I could wear around the house sometimes or whenever I do videos like this. So that's um that's something I want to bring in the future. You know, I have a um in the uh, up in town there is a shirt store. And I'm really hoping that whenever we get to that point, I can probably go up there, talk to them, and work out a good partnership with them. That's something I'm hoping for in the future that I can definitely do, you know, have some shirt designs, some hats, beanies, you know, just some awesome things for you guys to be able to enjoy. Some more physical material other than just having game nights, you know, stuff that you guys can really be proud of having. Or maybe even a blanket like this. You know, I had went to um, RTX last year, and I... I love Rooster Teeth, and that's something, you know, I love those guys, the animated series Red vs. Blue, one of my favorite series of all time, and I got this blanket, and, you know, I've had it up behind me, and I, I really like it being behind me, it's just, it's awesome, I love it being there, even though I don't ever really see it, but it is, um, you know, I love, it's just supporting them, that's what it's all about, guys, so, you know, last thing on my list, so, we're getting down to the end of the video, guys, but real quick, we're going to talk about a, another teaser that I have. You know, for any gearheads that are watching this video, comment down below. Let me know. And if any of the gearheads are Mitsubishi fans, let me know down in the comments because we will become new best friends very quickly. So that is something that um, is a little bit of a teaser. I've been talking to my dad, and he's wanting to start a YouTube channel about what we do here at the house with all of our project cars and work um, you know he's been a mechanic for self-employed mechanic for roughly 40 years and that's something that he's brought me into as well as a job that I can do as well as this um, my YouTube passion so that's something that we're wanting to bring we have a 98 Eclipse GST that we are going to be building very soon and once it's done, whenever we have the videos of us building it, we're going to be taking it to a local track and racing it. And then uh, shortly after, we'll be selling it. So that is something, you know, if you guys are interested in seeing that, definitely definitely let me know down in the comments. That's something that will be coming in the near future, probably within the next month maybe. I'm not sure just yet, but it is something that is coming. I may even post a little bit of a teaser trailer for you guys um, here in the next few weeks. So definitely check that out let me know down in the comments if that's something you're interested in so guys really we're coming down to the very end of the video and I'm not not really sure what else to say you know that's that's all I've got on my points and I really I just want to say thank you to all of our new subscribers you know if you aren't subscribed and you're still watching this I also want to thank you for sticking around you know definitely hit that subscribe button check out all of our videos all of our content we're gonna be bringing some more let's plays and just hilarious moments that T-Boss and I encounter on our gaming adventures, our day-to-day -day adventures. Guys, we have so much planned and in store for the future. Definitely stick around. We have a lot coming. So guys, as we're winding down, definitely smash that like button. It'll really help us out. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. That will also really help us out. And hit that notification bell to stay up to date on all of our uploads every Monday and Friday. And even a few other days just to keep you on your toes. We want to surprise you a little bit here and there. So, guys, that's all I have to say. This has been Mr. J313, and I will catch you on the next one.